Jim Creighton of ARI on the company's expansion into the global fleet markets through its extensive global alliance. We've been in North America for, for many years, and we, we've got a very strong hold in, in Canada, U.S., Mexico, Puerto Rico. We made our first foray into the U.K. Um, a year ago. We made an acquisition, a company by the name of Fleet Services Group, which we now refer to as ARI UK. And that's our first foray. It's, it's not on the continent of Europe, but it's, it's over on the other side of the, uh, of the pond. So we have um, uh, staff there, um, both, both uh, driver-based services and vehicle-based services, no leasing, it's just fleet management services. And that's where we think that we can bring value to that marketplace. Uh, we have no appetite for leasing at this time, especially closed-end leasing. The, the market in Europe is still very volatile. The banks and, the, and the, the, the banks that own a lot of leasing companies, they're still under a lot of pressure for their returns, and the market is just starting to hopefully turn in the right direction. We're focusing our attention on fleet management services, so maintenance, accident, driver-based programs is where we're focusing our attention right now. We do have intentions to expand elsewhere in Europe, and when the right opportunity comes along, we'll, we'll probably make a move elsewhere on the continent of Europe itself. We, we are constantly expanding our support for our global alliance within, within ARI. We have uh, beefed up our staff, uh, added staff uh, both in Europe and in New Jersey to support it. And again, from an integration and learning, making sure that more and more areas within the company understand what our partners' goals and aspirations are around the world. And then also, what can we do to support that? So is it data integration? Is it report generation? Is it sharing of best practices? It's uh, um, you know, literally sending staff from our company to our partners and our partners to spend time with us. And uh, one thing that's very flattering is our partners want to learn more and more about the North American marketplace because they think that's where the best and brightest fleet management ideas are coming these days, and they want to learn and absorb as much as possible. We, we understand the European marketplace is different, and we try to ob observe and understand Europe as best as possible, and we align ourselves with a lot of different people in Europe. Uh, there is no one-stop solution in Europe, so we try to make sure we understand what's best practices in each market for each type of fleet, be it a car fleet, a truck fleet, a large fleet, a small fleet, and we align ourselves accordingly in Europe, and we're always picking the brains of our European alliance partners also, and then trying to find out what it is our customers want and making sure we, we dig to get what they need to answer their questions, be it selector-based, CO2 emission-based, um, regulations, taxes, whatever. We, we, we go wherever we go uh, to get that information. But we try to make sure our people back in the home office in New Jersey, in our call centers in Texas, in our call centers and operations in Canada and Mexico, understand what's going on in the global marketplace also. So